Hello, in this video we're going to look at finding a point on an indifference curve. Leo's utility function is written as follows. Utility u equals x to the one-half power times y. A point on Leo's indifference curve occurs at x equals 25 and y equals 10. We want to find several other points on this same indifference curve. First, we're going to find the level of utility associated with this indifference curve. We're going to take our utility function here, and for x we're going to plug in 25, and for y we're going to plug in 10. So doing that, the square root of 25 is 5, and then we multiply that by 10, we get a utility of 50. So to find some points on Leo's indifference curve, we have to find where utility equals 50. Leo is on an indifference curve then where u equals 50. So the first point I'm going to find, take the utility function, set u equal to 50, and we can let x equal 1. I could let x equal any value, but letting x equals 1 is simple enough. Plugging this 1 in for x, and now solving for y. So the square root of 1 is just 1, so y equals 50. So one point on an indifference curve where utility equals 50 occurs where x equals 1 and y equals 50. If we're to plug this consumption point back into the utility function, utility would equal 50. Point 2, same thing, set utility equal to 50. And this time let x equal 4. Again, I could pick any value here, but 4 is good as any. We're going to take the square root of 4. That gives us 2. Dividing through by 2 and solving for y, y equals 25. So another point on Leo's indifference curve when utility equals 50 occurs when x equals 4 and y equals 25. We can again double check our math by plugging x equals 4 and y equals 25 into our utility function and then simplifying and we see we get u equals 50. And our third point here Starting off the same way, setting u equal to 50. This time we can let y equal some value. We don't always have to set x equal to something, so let's let y equal 5. Plugging that into our equation here. And now solving this here for x. First going to divide through by 5, so 50 divided by 5 is 10. And then we need to square both sides to get rid of this x to the 1 half power. We're going to square both sides, so squaring 10 we get 100, and we found yet another point on Leo's indifference curve. Where x equals 100 and y equals 5, Leo will be getting 50 units of satisfaction. Okay, that's it.